Who's going to tell you about the English trans the English work and Spanish? So Tarja. Oh, you so, gave me my props. Thank you. So look, thank you so much for for coming, everyone. Gosh, this is like our fourth uh, event, and we can't actually believe that time has gone by so fast. Actually, it just seems like seems like days ago that we were standing here with far less books out and far less work done, but. We're incredibly, incredibly enthused and happy because uh, we've covered a lot of ground in the last year. And we've now got, in English, we've re-released, uh, I think, 20 or 21 of our dad's books in English uh, editions, all kinds of new English editions in um, print-on-demand uh, print, in e-book, audiobook editions as well, as well as... Um, yeah, um, all kinds of new limited editions for the future. So we're really, really enthusiastic. And we are massively, massively thankful to the friends, to you guys, because as the year goes on, you know, I live in a kind of a bubble of emails mostly, hundreds and hundreds of emails to my team who I'm working with, and Holly and Augustine who are involved deeply with this, this project. And often I just, I see um, messages from them and our, from our proofreaders and our editors and it's, it's quite easy to forget sometimes that it's you guys who make it all possible by your support and some of you have read our dad's books for decades and you have no idea what that means to us. It means, it means the world and equally we're totally delighted to see new faces every time and always comment on that, that that means that our dad's work is getting out there to new people. It means a huge, great deal to us. And so, as you know, you've probably seen, we're bringing out these uh, re-released versions. And we're, we've also um, just got funding, generous, very generous funding, for a Spanish series, a mirror project of the same work. So uh, here's the book of the book, which is obviously quite an easy one to translate <laughs> because it's only it's like 19 pages so I noticed that came out before any of the others but um, we're really I don't know we're like so thrilled because we we found ourselves at the cutting edge of this new model in publishing that um, we kind of we put together because we didn't have any other way to do it we didn't have money to print zillions of copies. So we're using um, new technology, and I noticed uh, actually a, a couple of weeks ago when a, a big sort of fancy American publisher was being interviewed on TV, he talked about a whole new model in publishing, and I was like, you bastard, that's exactly what we're doing. And maybe I like to think, uh, or I did then, that maybe he's copied us, but um, I'm sure he did, I'm sure he paid a fortune to a group who did. So I just want to finish by saying thank you and we have a set of new limited editions planned, five new uh, limited beautiful editions planned for uh, towards the end of the year. Um, we don't have the artwork here but uh, they will be available I hope, I hope by Christmas. Um, so look out for those and 
There are, I'm sorry, we didn't bring copies of these limited editions, but there are still some copies of those available as well. So again, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm going to hand you over to... Safia. Safia. Okay. Safia. My pro. All right. So anyone who has been to one of these do's knows that I'm usually standing about over there behind that wall, not holding a microphone. But I'm talking today because I want to actually, yeah, I want to introduce the children's books, which are is a project very, very close to my heart. We have. 12 books in production. These are the first four. There, we've been very, very lucky to find two um, illustrators who have done a fantastic job. There's Speak First and Lose and The Onion are done by an Iraqi illustrator girl. And they're absolutely incredible. I'm going to leave them over there so anyone who wants to look at them can. These two are ready. And then we have an, um, uh, a Canadian Indian illustrator who's work, working on another this is a work few in progress. titles. This is work in, in progress. And Tale of the Sands, which is down here in a smaller format, is also work in progress. We're, we're working on 12 titles altogether. And the idea is to, have, is to produce them in English, in, in English, in a large format, and to produce them in an equally large format in Afghan languages uh, and distribute them. That's why the for free for free. That's why the project is is so important to us, and we've deliberately gone for a larger format because we want to um, offer Afghan children, especially, a whole world on their lap when they open this book. There will be a whole a whole new perspective on life. We hope. Um, so we're very very happy with them. Uh, we couldn't have done it without support and donations. And, and can I just say, because the limited editions that many of you have bought have gone, the funds have gone in entirety to funding this project. So, um, and to, you know, bringing millions, hopefully in the future, millions of copies of books for free to kids in Afghanistan, which we, I, I'm hijacking your talk, That's but okay. okay. <laughs> All I want to say is, no, because we grew up with these stories mm -hmm. just like this, because some of them were written in the house, or a lot of them were written at Langton House when we were growing up there. So it means kind of the world to us, absolutely, that other kids will um, have them in their lives and in their imagination as well. What he said. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're part of the side of the to talk about the, no, the, the, the other editions, the, the translations. Hi there, and every year I update you on my project, which is really, I suppose you could summarize as going, uh, giving back in a way. My dad, uh, our, our dad took a, book, a lot of his material from Eastern sources and it's now very, very hard to come by uh, in those countries, which are many of which are, are now in the grips of extremism. So um, we, we proceed and we're proceeding very well, actually. We have, I have two enormous debts of um, really to uh, recognize. Uh, one is to Saadi, who rashly, a couple of years ago now is it, said to me that the De Afghan editions had some errors in them. And he is also an Iranian, so he, he sort of said, well, look, you really ought to have Iranian editions. So he has now been going through line by line uh, the translations. We've, we've had new translations done in Iranian Persian, and he has gone through line by line and discovered just how bad you know, most translators are. And so for his sins, you know, he's, he's now been forced to, forced to do it. And we've now got these beautiful Iranian Persian translations, three so far, two more are in production, and we have a, a list of 10 that we want to do. So um, really thank you to Saadi for, the, for that. And also immense thanks to Peter Davis, who has financed the translations into Iranian Persian. I don't know if he's here today. I was looking out for him. Yes, yes. So I'm very short-sighted, by the way. I'm smiling at you all, but I can just see a blur of faces. So
so thank you so much, Peter. Um, I've got some copies of these for you too. So uh, it's all carrying on. Um, uh, we're, we're hoping then to complete these cycles and just carry on. So we're delighted to be doing this. Thank you. So, thank you all very much. Now, and please be there. Thank you.